Hi there, I'm Brickster and welcome back to LEGO Mods and Mashups. Today we're once again taking a look at LEGO Ninjago City Garden set number 71741. Now, this set is my favorite set ever, probably. I mean, I really can't think of one that I like more and I've had a lot of sets that I've loved, so this is, you know, a, a, a pretty exceptional set. I highly encourage you picking it up if you can. It's expensive, but in my opinion, it's well worth it. There was one issue that I had with it. Only one. That says a lot, right? But like, one major issue. And that is that bit, pretty much all of these buildings and rooms you could uh, imagine being able to get into. Except like, a couple up here in the tower. But, I mean, you know, it's this little tower and they're ninjas, so we can, you know, imagine it. But down here, this little building right here, there's actually no way of getting into. There's no door or anything. So, I decided to try to remedy that. So let's take a look at how I created a way of getting from this building up into this building. This building obviously has a door that allows you to enter it but then this building up here as you can see only has windows there is however a hole down in here and so i added a ladder now a ladder doesn't work too well at first glance due to the fact that this is a storefront but i feel like this ladder works quite well in fact because it is retractable let's take a look at how it works Looking at the underside of this upper building, we see that this ladder is kind of just dangling here on this hinge. Now, if we grab it and pull it downwards, we see that it actually comes quite far down. Now, if we look down here, we see that it comes low enough that a minifig could potentially grab it and climb on up. It's better than not having anything at all, in my opinion. So how did I do this? Let's take a look. If we pop this whole section off, which is on really nice hinges, it's pretty incredible that they figured out the angle to do that at. Anyhow, taking off that whole hinge section, we see that rather than having two large two by four bricks like originally created, I switched out this bottom two by four for a one by two and a one by four, leaving this gap here. Now, in that gap, I put this, which is a one by two brick with two holes through it, two Technic pin holes. Then I simply added this Technic pin with a stud on it, and I slid this bar in there. This bar has some droid arms with a ladder attached to it. This whole assemblage simply pops right on there, and you can see it goes up and back down quite easily. You can slide it all the way over to the edge for minimal um, issues later on, and then simply rebuild this, putting everything back together, not too difficult there, and then you've got your ladder in there. Putting this back on top, we see that because it retracts quite far, it's not like, an issue, it doesn't really get in the way at all. And now as you can see, there is a ladder that can be used to access that upper apartment. So that's it for this modification. Great thing is from the outside, it looks exactly the same. I hope you enjoyed seeing how I figured out a way to fix that. Uh, let me know in the comments down below if you think that it improves the design. Please leave a like below if you enjoyed. Subscribe to the channel for more weekly modern mashup videos. And until next time, keep on building. Peace.